gotten that. I'll need to just keep getting uh, skill points and making greater mutagens, and then I could get all those things. Beautiful. I wanna do wine wars. I just wanna I just wanna do it. Nice. Beautiful. That's a bear. What bonus do I get again? Um so rare attacks deal 50% more damage and also stun opponents at the cost of one adrenaline point. Strong attacks increase fast attack damage for 5 seconds by 10% for each piece of the set. Nice. done a lot today. Barely anything towards the story, but <laughs> still fairly... Come here, boy. Here we go. I'm just trying to, to say thank you. <sighs> well, I'm off my bike. Please look fuck, it's so abandoned. Sorry, Roach is just a bit of a silly boy. No one gives a hoot about this <laughs> Let's go. Roach, you fucking pussy. Show me what you got. Centipede motherfuckers. Ow! What the fuck? Green centipede spawning ground. Should destroy it. Right. Anything else? Well, I don't think so. Time to speak to Liam and Matilda. To see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Roach, please. Me. 
This is why I don't ride him. He's just too much of a pussy. Can't be dealing with it. Totally gonna walk on him smooching, aren't I? They're gonna be like. Or they're gonna be dead. What they're dead. I'll be mad. Smooching or dead. It's the two options that I believe will happen. Oh, no, what the fuck? Vineyard should be in as good a shape uh, as can ever. you ask a question? Sure, Elended. you can ask a question. And thus, officially, by the power vested in me, Ooh, I, I grant you title to the Belgard Vineyard, and trust that you shall make good use of its grounds and resources. Excellent. Ah, I can already smell the grapes ripening into sun. We shan't forget what you did for us. Here. Your pay. Your land. But that's not all. You must come back and see us shortly. We've a surprise in store for you. I'll do that. Farewell. A surprise. Wait three days. Oh, Witcher, greetings. Kind of you to come. Matilda and I, we've a surprise for you. Hi. So you're doing well? Hmm. You two seem to be getting along. We are. There came a point we realized we had no grounds to quarrel. Things became altogether pleasant. And a bit spicy. Romantic. Quite. Got it. Needn't say more. Glad I things knew are they were well switching. Uh, what's the surprise? What's the surprise? What if it is Some question, no, Emil? Kill? What's no, the question? Something far more pleasant. We've produced a wine. According to the best sommeliers, it might just dethrone Estes. We owe this success to you. So, if you'd agree, we'd like to name it after you. What shall we call it? White Wolf. Why not White Wolf? Wild, with character. It fits perfectly. If you wouldn't mind, we'd like to send a few bottles to your home every so often. I'd be honored. Thanks. No, we thank you. Take you get free care, wine? Yo! You get free wine, bro. Let's see this fucking wine. Would have been really nice assisted to bloody call it um thingy, wouldn't it? Where is it? There it is. White wolf. Has no extra anything. Where is Est Est? There it is. Mad. That's some madders right there. It's been cucked at me question. Um Cool. What's that? Getting down to the nitty gritty. I feel like doing the fist fights. This guy's fairly close. Where is he?
Yeah. Right, Roach. Such a wet basket. These three in fist fights. Yes. It's thin scrapings around here. Oh. At yeah. least the battle is as devastating as his fists, huh? Witcher. Do you wish to jump in? Considering it. So you're not surprised. Consider this as well. Here. Intellect counts as much as strength. You see, Mancombe is no ordinary fighter. Mancombe. Mancombe. First I've ever encountered that name. One should never judge an opponent by his name. Master Mancombe is a saddle, though a valiant one at that. His blows are as fierce as his riposts are sharp. Okay, so we are. Fine, let's start. Oh, my knees quake like a carnival rattle. <gasps> let's get on with this ridiculous battle. I'm a top taunter, the best around, not one to be beaten by some inbred hound. <laughs> Guess you know, since your mom's a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> ah, pathetic. This will be easy. Oh dear. What's wrong? Afraid? Got feeling queasy? Yeah, you stink something vicious. It's making me sick. <laughs> Give it up. Go home. Your efforts are futile. Your wits as flaccid as a wet noodle. Done with this. You're weak. Just trying to avoid a fight. Let's end this pitiful farce. You, a Witcher, are the dullest man alive. Put up your guard. Finally. I want to take his fucking earring off him. Just looks dumb. Ow. What the? What the fuck? Bro! I'm fucking doing the fucking thing and it's not fucking doing it. Fucking hell, it's too much sweet. Um Your taunts? Well how then is this for a clever tongue twister? You're a bum botching black and bile filled blister. I think you're confused. That sounds more like your sister. I'm immune to disease, but even I'd die if I kissed her. Oh. You aren't worthy to empty my sister's bedpan. You mange-ridden mutant, not even a man. Should have quit before we began. Gotta make you wish you'd turn tail and ran. Why, you... bad... Uh... Uh, I've got to admit, <laughs> you know how to roast a man. You win. Mean we're not gonna fight? Why? I told you, you've won. 
The Witcher wins, beating Mancombe at his own game. Oh. You out-tongued me, but only because I'm under the weather today. I'd have lashed you raw otherwise. Right. Sure. Okay. That was a weird one. Two more champions to defeat before you can challenge the Maestro. Still Waters is to be found in Oatville, not far from Mountbank Alley. While Colossus fights in the largest courtyard in San Sebastian. Cool. Right. Stance. There's one. The Guardian Embassy. Oh. oh. Cool. Lose all that fucking hell. A witcher. A witcher. Mm. A man of action, a man of valor. Are you not? Would you care to check yeah. still? You gave me never you are. The air here is such that Shall you face off against still waters? Shall you? Shall you? Like to know who I'm punching. This knight won't reveal his name or face, won't say anything at all, not a word. Rein in your curiosity, sir. A knightly vow is no idle promise. Still waters shall conceal both face and crest until such time as one defeats him. So, will you fight or not? I challenge you to a duel. <laughs> Miss a woman. <laughs> Noble lords and virtuous <laughs> That's funny. Another fight <laughs> is soon to begin. Oh, can't it be feet? Get yeah, fucked, bitch. Ladies and gentlemen, the Witcher defeats the previously invincible Stillwaters. And what about it was? Freed of his vow, the knight can now show his face. Your blows are strong and true. My congratulations. Thanks. Have you naught to add? I'm a woman. No wry remarks? What for? It's the 13th century. Nothing <laughs> peculiar about it. Women own taverns, run farms, and fight. Will you not claim there was no honor in fighting a wench? No. I'd expect to hear that from someone who was afraid to lose to a woman. Now only Colossus stands between you and a chance at the Maestro. San Sebastian, that's where you should go. Look for the largest courtyard. Aye. Come here. I guess I guess they do that just so um Do you know the colors I would In case you like get rid of like the mini map and stuff. Make it more authentic. Who's selling paintings? I'd like to purchase some. I'd like to purchase all your paintings. What do you mean, what happened to my head, you motherfucker? A smashing place we have. A smashing place we have. Yeah, vaults, mein fear. I heard old Victor Monard has breathed his last. Yes, he did. Quite a 
past the witcher. Will you? Oh, now you look to be a man in search of exertion. Hey, White Locks, will you dare to fight Colossus? Yeah, pierce nipples. Colossus. Interesting as monikers go. Or is that what his mother called him out of the womb, too? Why would she not have? Colossus. It rings out with pride and passion. So, will you fight? Yeah, go on. Fine. Let's fight. Ah, boring. I'm not interested. Quick I am. Too quick for you. It'll be knick-knack, patty-whack. Kiss your arm bone. Where's the sport in it? Don't want to fight? Why bother looking for challengers then? Wasting my time. Whoa, a bit testy, are we? A witcher, right? Let's do it like this. You parry three blows I throw your way, you win. But you can't swing at me, not once. Just deflect my blows, got it? Catch three of them, and I'll toss you double your wager. Feeling that generous? No, well, I just know you can't do it. It's not fucking no working, so what's the fucking fasts. point? So, willing to try for three blocks? Go on, Em. Fine. That I get. At long last, one with a spook. Fucking get on with it. I've had enough. <laughs> Incredible! The Witcher has parried Colossus's blows. No one's ever managed that feat. Here's your due. Thanks. You've earned my esteem, sir. We've not seen such a feat in years. And thus, you've secured the right to challenge the Maestro himself. You'll find him by the docks. Hi. Fucking let me save! I... Sometimes it does my fucking swede. Well, sir, I am the White Wolf. No witches, whatever. Yes, he has let you drunk the gutter again. Go get this braid. Where I find the boxer they call the Maestro. Maestro, champ, the undefeated. Folk call him many things. You are the Witcher who dropped the three lesser champions? I am. Come to fight the Maestro, but seems to me he's indisposed. Alcohol is the Maestro's remedy for his crippling shyness. He's a delicate man, you see? <laughs> He'd never so much as hit a pillow while sober. Fighting sobers like dancing to silence. Forget fighting. Sure you can stand? You're blind drunk. Not your bum bumping business. Ah, you cheat, you chat while my vodka's gone flat. Will you fight, yay or nay? Alright. Let's go. I challenge you. Hold on. Whoa. I am a man of principle. I keep to a code. I don't tinkle where I eat, and I don't fight folk who don't drink. Meaning? Meaning you're to drink, or hey diddle diddle out of here. All right. Sheesh. Fine. 
Mesdames, messieurs, the maestro will perform at last. This is going to be funky. Let's do this. Happened in years. Your fists, they're glorious. Let me stick up at your belt. Thanks. I'm gobsmacked, I am. I have to drink it off. Oh, good fight. To speak through, I'm pleased you stripped me of the title. I shall have more time to pursue my chief interest now. Which your Geralt of Rivia is hereby crowned Fisticuffs champion of Beauclair. Bravo! Behold your trophy. A life without liquors like loving without licking. Oh, a trophy. Perfect. Where's my trophy? Is that it? It's a fucking dildo. Now I can do this one. Wait, where's that? Oh, I like how this is actually all fucking on the fucking map. Bro, I want to do this now. Work, wrath, and women. Hey, there. How much for your work? Vickers, Russians. That witch is rather handsome. Let's see you, Stop. Step into my parlor, my good sir. What brings you I to I think I sir? found a naughty place. Hmm. Let's call it business. Ah, then. A professional journey. Nothing but work, tension, unfamiliar beds. One needs a way to relax at times. Perhaps my curse could help you. Cozy place you got. I'm pleased you noticed. You see, when I had set aside enough to found my own establishment, I wished it to be not a body house, but a body home. A place where patrons would not simply come, drop their hosts, then flee as soon as the girl rolled over. Here, the shit do not reek of sweat, the bets have no bed bugs, and the wine is not watered down. It is a place where one longs to live. Really? To chat, sprawled in a comfortable chair, to light a pipe. All after paying a modest glad. fee, of course. Please. Interested in the unusual. Got a special request. Just need to keep this between you and me. You know, well, I shouldn't. Hey, who cares? How might I help? Gwent, you play? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that sounded so sus, bro. I 
actually not long. Boys. Want to let loose, enjoy myself. Of course. Talk to the girls. I'm certain they will do all in their power. And it's quite a lot, believe you me. Oh. What say you, Shh. You needn't apologize. You needn't worry about a thing. You've come to enjoy some pleasant moments. To rest. Relax. Let me help you do just that. There you Tell me a bit about yourself. <clears throat> My name is Madeline. I like to walk barefoot in the grass, uh, read by candlelight, and drink young wine straight from the bottle. You're sweet. Don't let appearances fool you. <laughs> Who's killed? Take me to your room. With pleasure. I ain't showing nothing, bro. Why does it shoot this one? It's only like certain set things. Showing the one where she's scared. I give only when the urge strikes me. So, willing to show me if your birthday suit is equally becoming? Don't beat around the bush, do you? 
I dislike pretending to be someone I am not. All the sighs, fainting, fluttering eyelashes, it's just not me. I operate on the assumption that if a man seeks coyness, he does not go to a brothel. Right about that. Definitely had something else in mind. Then come and show me. Oh my Jesus. Somewhere secluded. Wait, it's doing the same one! But why is she scared? I'm so confused. Like the, game, the game don't know what it wants to do. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna skip this, because I've already seen this one. I'm just gonna keep this scene until we do this. Well, uh, maybe not. Let's talk to oh every. boy, another one. What's that? Another what? Did Madame Isabel mention role playing costs extra? If you wish to play at being a witcher, then. Misunderstanding, I'm afraid. I am a witcher. Of course. The eyes. I should have noticed. Forgive me, master. Come into my alcove, and I shall more than make up for my error there. The, uh, playing it being a witcher thing. What's that about? Ah, it's the latest rage. A trick will come, dressed in a studded jacket, two swords on his back, and ask me to play a succubus or a silent. Then he'll say he has a contract, but his codex says he cannot harm a thinking being. So perhaps we can make a deal. Once it's over, he demands some kind of card. I've no notion how it started. They probably took the idea from one of those silly ballads. Mm -hmm. Got a strong suspicion who the author might be. <gasps> oh! Oh, That's I know exactly! Strange. Come! Oh, the fucking first game, honestly. Uh oh. I have just showed stuff I don't want to show because I pressed the wrong one. Monka, Monka is Monka. Few spot key points in. Giving him a nice massage on his back. He's to slap his bum. Disgusted in myself. Okay. What chair? The freshest sword. Hot sausage links. Ripe blood pudding. Uh, like to buy something? Fine. Show me what you got. I want to buy something. I don't think I do. Should I just sell him all my meat? Run out of money, what a pussy. Oh, for some gwent. No, you're busy, but. Scurvy Hanses, how is a man to live? Damn it. 
otra. Oh, no, we like saving up. My beast. Done that guy? The heck is wrong with me? I didn't do the herbalist. The fuck is wrong with me? I'm getting to that guy. The fuck is wrong with me? Oh my god! Zoom. Put away. Put away. Fucking hell. They're counting shit at me, Geralt. Listen, good folk. Listen here. I was an Ophiri prince once. Where's the cut gone this time? Ophiri prince and fucking make me laugh, bro. Hi. Sir, my eyes were not deceived. Yet so far south, you, sir, of all folk in all your fame. Mm-hmm. Me, south in all my fame. Ah, oh, I've heard so much. Why, when Master Dandelion tarried in Beauclair, not a day passed without him baying out a ballad in admiration of your deeds. <laughs> yeah. Unwelcome little habit of his. But, what can I do for you? Ah, you see my betrothed, Francois Le Goff, vowed in my honor to bring me the head of the horrid beast they call Gratore. Mm. Couldn't have gotten you a bouquet, some sweets in a bag. Witcher, sir, you jest. A love most true demands proof through heroic deeds dedicated to the heart's captor. But alas... Francois has been gone a fortnight. Thus, I must plead with you to see what's become of him. Could you? Would you? Ah. Uh. This Gratore. Know anything else about it, mademoiselle? Judging by the name, guessing it lives in a cave. Yes. From which it prowls when hungry. By night, when all are asleep, it creeps into villages. Then, of a sudden breaks open shutters, 
reaches inside and snatches babes from their cradles so quickly they've not the time to yelp. Hmm. Nocturnal. Long prehensile arms. Intelligent. Francois claimed he would cut the filth down in a snap. But he's been gone so long. Will you help, sir? I cannot sleep. I feel this worrying for uh, the death of me. I guess so. Up on my reward, though. Rarely my want to turn down a damsel in distress. Even less so when there's a... <clears throat> prize involved. Ah, naturally. Why, you, sir, are no knight errant, but a guildsman, an expert. How much would you need? That's a bit much, isn't it? A few crones less, master. A fistful. I beg you, sir. Yes. That amount I am prepared to pay. Let's go. Do my damnedest to get your fiancé back safe and sound. Just, uh, mind telling me where to look for him? I forget you come from afar and do not know our land. They say Grotore has its lair in the caves at the foot of the Gorgon Hills. That close to the city? Telling me no bold souls have ventured out to defeat the beast? Quite the contrary. Plenty have. But none's returned. My concern is well founded. I see. Okay. All right. High time I set off. A tree fucker? Okay, I... I hate when it does that. With one Very slot good. free for anyone willing to play the Skellige deck. Work, I assure one. you, Skellige is just as strong as the other factions. It shall soon be considered canon, of this I'm certain. I don't know. Always been an Ilfgaard man myself. I must give it some more thought. Geralt of Rivia saw a notice about a Gwent tournament. By all means, you've come to the right place. I am Count Martin Monnier, organizer in chief. Our okay. turn is more than mere diversion. We've a mission, see, to spread word of my brother's brainchild, Skellige, a new Gwent faction. Um, tell me about these new cards. Tell me something about them. Their design embodies the Isle's spirit, the rage filled potency, the rough. Brutal beauty. Famed Skelligers, heroes of lore, berserkers and beasts, ogle us from the cards. Bran Twirsek is the faction's leader, of course. And the other famous Skelligers? Yalmar and Serison Kreite, naturally, though not conjoined. Also Hemdal the hero, the venerable druid Ermion, the list goes on. Where'd you get the idea? New deck. Where to get the idea? I mean, why bother? All Beauclair knows me as a great lover and promoter of Gwent. My brother, dead for some time now, was known to be the same. We shared another great passion, travel. Spent a great many years at sea in our youth, marking out our territory <laughs> in multiple corners of the world. Yet the one that truly grabbed us by the stones were the Skellige Isles. The stormy sea, consumed by a fever, a suicidal orb, dashing itself against somber cliffs. That is the image I retain. It and others like it 
inspired my brother to devise the new faction. <sighs> the tournament. Where do I sign up to play? Right here with me. I've one slot open, but there's a condition. You must use cards of the Skellige faction. You see, I've already asked a great many seasoned players to do the same. Alas, all fear novelties, disdain process, care too much for the climax for winning. So they insist on playing with their tried and true decks. Long story short, you need a sucker who will risk it. Take a stab at proving Skellig is no worse than the established decks. Best way to do that would be to win this tournament using your brother's cards. We understand one another perfectly, I see. Behold this trophy, standing stiff and strong. It could be yours if you win. All right, I'll give it a shot. Play using the new faction. That is an exceedingly good rub to my loins. Just one small adjoinder. I can only provide you a basic Skellige deck. My brother, alas, gave away or lost many key cards. Okay. No chance I can win the tournament with these cards? An issue easily resolved. You must simply face local Gwent competitors, win the missing cards from them. Besides, it would be very good practice for the tournament itself. Here, the cards I can spare you. Take them, please. The rest I keep for myself, for I too intend to play as Skellige. Already got a good enough deck to play in the tournament of Skellige. Might I have a peek? You do indeed. Come back in two days' time, then, for the start of the tourney. Ah. Check. From the tourney. I see. None of which I should even show myself in. Quite hard to scratch under metal quizzes, you know. Did you the skeleton deck? Triggers tran it transformation of all berserker flying. Okay. Decoy, come on, it's her own scorch and clear weather.
it's 238. Okay. We'll try it. Wipe your boots before you take another step. Don't slurp your food. Don't eat with your hands. Don't pick your teeth with your knife. All right, what? bloody hell. Oh, I'm just jesting. You, sir, clearly were not born in a barn. Welcome to the pheasantry. The best auberge in all the duchy. Uh, giraffe. Run and went. I know you're busy, but I use him, Skellige. Oh, I didn't choose the fucking. I I fucked myself. What is this? I don't know what does. Why am I like kissing this guy? <laughs> <laughs> 